Hi, someone said something I don't agree with. I am so offended. I need a safe space. <laughs> this is a safe space. You can be as offended and pathetic as you want to be. Hi, did you know every year hurt feelings result in a staggering zero deaths? This is far too many. And all these deaths could be prevented if we had government subsidized safe spaces. But luckily, now we do. Through strategic defunding of the police and canceling of the Feeding the Hungry programs, we've been able to launch the nationwide Safe Space Hotline. Uh, you don't think we should have an open border? You just want people to die. I'm literally shaking right now and I don't know what to do. In the past, this person would not have a safe space, which means they would be stuck stewing in the swamp of their own mental instability all by themselves. But that changes now with the Safe Space Hotline. Welcome to the Safe Space Hotline. <laughs> with the launch of the Safe Space Hotline, now they have someone to create a safe space for them while they stew in the swamp of their own mental instability. If he runs again, you would vote for Donald Trump? Safe Space Hotline. <sighs> <laughs> I'm here to listen to you victimize yourself. At the Safe Space Hotline, we know that you're mentally ill enough to believe that how you make yourself feel is someone else's fault based on how you perceive their words and filter them through your undealt with insecurities which cause you to victimize yourself as you blame someone else for what you're doing to yourself. And we cater to that. Safe Space Hotline. He, he called me by the wrong pronoun. Ah. What are your pronouns? Them, sir. Wow, those don't sound made up. And I can't believe he didn't know those are your pronouns. It's so obvious. Could you hysterically tell me how bad that made you feel? Ah. At the Safe Space Hotline, we'll reinforce the disempowering narrative that it's always someone else's fault. The Safe Space Hotline doesn't offer anything helpful but it does offer a safe space. But research does show that safe spaces assist a person in avoiding inner discomfort that could otherwise catalyze them into self-responsibility for their life experiences that could better their life. And this is essential because you can't victimize yourself if you're working on bettering yourself. And you can't weaken a nation of people if they're working on bettering themselves. But you can if you get that nation of people to believe that victimizing themselves is empowerment. Accordingly, the Safe Space Hotline is funded in part by the George Soros Foundation for the building of a worse America and is backed by all the leftist politicians that he and the World Economic Forum have placed into power. Safe Space Hotline. I can't even. You are so brave to be weak enough to not be able to even. The next time someone says something that you don't like, instead of being an adult, break down and call the Safe Space Hotline. 1-800-I'M-A-VICTIM. We'll be here to listen to you ramble aimlessly as you blame someone else for how you made yourself feel.